Hi, this is Dr. Materi. In this video, we will be discussing how to restrain large birds safely. Restraining parrots is a daily occurrence at our practice so that our veterinarians can perform physical examinations, diagnostics, and provide treatments to our patients. At home, large parrots may need to be restrained by an owner so that they can give their pet prescribed medications, assess any wounds that might be present, or do nail trims or wing clips. In order to be successful, an appropriately sized tight weave towel with no holes is essential. Towels allow hands to be hidden in order to protect them from bites. Also, the towel can be draped over the bird during capture so that the wings are protected. Another advantage to using towels is that the bird does not see the hands during capture so that it will not become hand shy. It may become towel shy, however. Heavy gloves are not normally used for parrots. The bird may associate a gloved hand with a bare hand, leading to the fear of hands entirely, and gloves will not protect the wings as effectively as a towel. It is very important that proper holding technique is used when handling birds. Free movement of the chest is essential for allowing birds to breathe properly. They do not possess a diaphragm, and excessive pressure on their sternum will restrict breathing and is very dangerous. When you are handling your bird, carefully monitor it for any signs of discomfort, stress, or breathing difficulty, including open mouth breathing. Be prepared to release the bird, either on the floor or back in the cage, if it appears to be in distress. Birds with severe respiratory disease can decompensate and even die of stress too much. You should also be aware that white-faced birds, such as macaws and African greys, can develop bruises when excessive pressure is placed on the sides of their face. Please know that these bruises are harmless and temporary. Any attempts to capture and restrain a bird should be done in a safe environment with windows covered, doors closed, and fans turned off. Once the bird is in the towel, the head and neck area is gripped with one hand just under the base of the beak by gently circling the neck with the thumb and index finger. There are two ways to control the body. One way is to control the feet with the other hand, allowing the bird to be gently stretched between the holder's two hands to prevent the bird from struggling or reaching around and biting. The wings are prevented from flapping by wrapping the bird's body in a towel or bringing it close to the holder's body. The other way to control the body is to lightly wrap the towel around the body to restrain the wings and feet. Remember, do not put too much pressure over the chest. The capture technique is fairly simple, but of course requires practice. Some birds may allow the towel to be placed around them while they are standing on a table or on their cage. Tame birds, such as this macaw, can be easily caught and will allow the towel to be wrapped around them. To do this, firmly hold the bird's toes and then place the short end of the towel over your forearm near the bird's feet. This often distracts the bird, which will allow you to take the longer end of the towel and drape it over the bird from behind. Once the towel has been gently wrapped around the bird, locate the head and grasp it from behind through the towel. While holding the head with one hand, use the other hand to lightly wrap the towel around the body to restrain the wings and feet. Untamed or nervous birds are more difficult to capture. If trying to catch such a bird from inside the cage, try and remain as calm as possible and wait for the bird to face away from you or start climbing the cage bars. This will enable the head and neck area to be grabbed from behind. If successful, wrap the towel around the body. If the bird is difficult to capture, then remove the perches and toys from the cage. This next video shows a parrot that will not stop facing the towel and will roll over on its back. In this case, Use two hands holding the bunched up towel to try and scoop the bird up, then quickly gain control of the head. Your capture technique will improve over time, so do not give up. Just remember, practice makes perfect. The next two videos show how to place a towel over a parrot that has stepped up onto the hand. While it is important to grasp the feet firmly, you may need to release the bird if excessive twisting is occurring to prevent the bird from hurting itself. Again, a small amount of towel is placed in front of the bird by their feet 
while the remainder of the towel is draped behind them so that their head and neck area can be quickly grabbed. Being patient and talking to your bird in a calm, soothing voice can sometimes be helpful. For more information about restraining parrots, please contact our clinic. Thanks for watching.